afternoon and welcome to Holy Trinity Episcopal Church in Juneau, Alaska for noon day prayers. Blessed be the Lord who forgives all our sins, whose, whose mercy endures forever. forever. I give I you worship with all my whole life. I give you reverence with my whole understanding. I give you love with my whole heart. I give you my all, O God of all gods. Christ, give us grace to grow in holiness, to deny ourselves and take up our cross and follow him. Psalm appointed for today is 95. Come, let us sing to the Lord. Let us make a joyful noise to the rock of our salvation. Let us, Let us come, come into his presence with thanksgiving. Let us, Let us make joyful noise to him with songs of praise. For the Lord is a great God and a great King above all gods. In his hand are the depths of the earth, the heights of the mountains are his also. The sea is his, for he made it, and the dry land which his hands have formed. O oh, come, let us worship and bow down, and let us kneel before the Lord our Maker. For he is our God, and we are the people of his pasture, and the sheep of his hand. Oh, that, oh, that today you would listen to his voice. Do not harden your hearts as in Meribah, as on the day of Manasseh in the wilderness, when your ancestors tested me and put me to the proof, though they did not, though they had seen my work. For, For forty, 40 years, years I looked at that generation, generation and said, They are people, people whose hearts are astray, and, and they, they, they do not regard my ways. Therefore, in my my anger, I swore, they shall not enter in my rest. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. A reading from Corinthians. Now you are the body of Christ, and individually members of it. And God has appointed in the church first apostles, second prophets, third teachers, then deeds of power, then deeds of healing, forms of assistant, forms of leadership, and various kinds of tongues. Are all prophets? Are all prophets and apostles? Are all teachers? Do all work miracles? Do all possess gifts of healing? Do all speak in tongues? Do all interpret? But strive for the greater gifts, and I will show you a still more excellent way. If I speak in tongues of mortals and of angels, but do not have love, I am a noisy gong or a clanging cymbal. If I have prophetic powers and understand all mysteries and all knowledge, and if I have all faith so as to remove mountains, but have not love, I am nothing. If I give away all my possessions, and if I hand over my body so that I may boast, but do not have love, I have gained nothing. Hear what the Spirit is saying to God's people. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. Lord, have mercy. Christ, Christ have mercy. mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, hear our prayer, and our cry come to you. 
Let us pray. O oh God of grace and mercy, give your blessings to the Diocese of Alaska. Watch over our churches, sustain our people, strengthen our leaders. Through the Holy Spirit, guide and guard the diocese, keeping it always under your care and protection. Let us be a loving family, serving you in faithful devotion to the gospel of your Son, Jesus Christ. Give your blessings to Mark, our bishop. Give him a spirit of courage and right judgment, a spirit of knowledge and love. Let your Holy Spirit be his companion. Let your gospel be always in his thoughts. May your presence in his life be a light for all to see in every good work for the building up of your people and to the glory of your holy name. Give us the blessing of your example. Help us to follow in the way of Jesus today and every day. Give us compassion at the center of all that we do. Compassion for ourselves as disciples still young in faith. Compassion for others as members of our own family in God. Let us become examples for others as so many others have been examples to us through your love and for the sake of your glory. Watch over all elders and the brothers and sisters of the Society of St. Simeon and St. Anna. If any are in a time of sorrow, sickness, or need, give them the touch of your healing hand. If any are in times of joy, thanksgiving, or fulfillment, give them the songs of angels to praise your name. Let us be your servants in this life, just as we will be your sons and daughters in the life to come. I invite your own intercessions and prayers at this time. Amen. Today the church remembers Frederick Denison Morris, priest and theologian. Almighty God, who has restored our human nature to the heavenly glory through the perfect obedience of our Savior Jesus Christ, enliven in your church, we pray, a passion for justice and truth that like your servant Frederick Denison Maurice, we may work and pray for the triumph of the kingdom of your Christ, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. May God's love be the love that surrounds us today. May God's peace be the peace that we share on our way. May God's grace be the grace that our actions display. May God's truth be the truth in the words that we say. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. Working and praying, may we walk in the way of Christ, of the cross, each hour of this day. Amen. Amen.